great event. Those of you who have never attended the 12 Taste of Christmas with Taste of University, you are indeed for a treat um, for a variety of foods, and it's a wonderful, wonderful jazz um, annual event for Texas Southern University. On this coming Saturday, as always every year, I have the honor of joining the brothers of Kappa Alpha Psi of the Trinity for their annual day of keynote uh, with KK Psi. So I look forward to joining them at the HEB store on OST. I want to thank HEB for their partnership with Kappa Alpha Psi. And the event will begin at 11 o'clock a.m. Uh, for those persons who live in that area, we'll be giving away food uh, for the holidays. So I look forward to being with them on Saturday. As, um, I'm so proud of my staff. Uh, we're getting ready to culminate uh, another wonderful year. Um, this year, the, um, throughout the year, we host various days of caring in the district where we provide food for the less fortunate and the underprivileged. And I just asked my staff, how many did we do this year? And so I just want to commend them for a wonderful year. We've done 14 days of caring in the district. When we partnered with the Houston Food Bank, we've given over 4, 448,000 pounds of food this year. And so we'll have our last event at the Yellowstone Academy on this coming Saturday in the northern part of Third Ward at 3000 Trolley um, in Third Ward uh, in the gym. The event will begin from 10 to 1 o'clock p.m. And I want to thank my staff for coordinating this event, um, headed up by uh, Valerie Tara. Just want to thank her so much for those 14 days of giving this year, because we cannot forget those that are less fortunate to make sure they have the proper food uh, throughout the district. So I just want to salute uh, my staff on that. And Mayor, I want to thank you because um, this year you had initiatives to house the homeless in your heart for the veterans. And I just want to thank you so much for what you do to make sure that our homeless, that they have a place to stay in your partnership with the Housing Authority of the City of Houston and Tory under his leadership. Because I know you did 100 homes for veterans. I want to thank you for that. And now you raised the bar to do 1,000 homes for homeless. And also, and really looking at ways that we can coordinate this program, my understanding is that there will be a homeless coordinator that will be hired for the City of Houston to really look at ways that we can better uh, house our homeless population. So I want to thank you for that, for your leadership and really taking our homeless population, like you said, uh, that's going to be a top priority this year for this two years. And I want to thank you for doing that. You need to be saluted for that. So hopefully, I know the City of Houston will get many awards for what we do for economic growth. So I hope someone will really look at uh, your leadership this year on how we really put homelessness a priority in the city. So again, salute to you. And then finally, my staff in my office, Risha Beatty, please give me a turn up so I can just hear her. Um, she received her award, and over 3,000 family members and friends cheered on for 2,500 runners that participated in the Metro PC Dallas Marathon, the half marathon that was held on last Sunday, um, to benefit the children's, the Scottish Rights Hospital for Children for treatment for pediatric orthopedic conditions. Salute to you, Risha. Mayor, this was one of her bucket lists, under 30 bucket lists. So she completed the half marathon, 13.1 mile course. And she told me to let you all know that she received her medal, but she was not the last person. So congratulations, Risha. Great training for the last uh, six or seven months. Uh, I'm proud, and so everybody can see your medal. And now that's it, you can take it home now, because I know you've been wearing it all week. So thank you, Risha. Council members, Thank you, ma'am.